What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Alpha Sapphire walkthrough. Okay, so, in our last episode, we went through all of this, the Granite Cave, or not, is it the Granite Cave, or what, what where the heck, Mount Chimney, yes. We went through Mount Chimney, defeated uh, Team Aqua, you know, and uh, yeah, now it is time, finally time to go to the Jagged Pass. Now, there is just one little issue, and that is that I forgot to switch bikes. So, we're going to have to go twice into the uh, the Jagged Pass just to show you guys what happens when you have the Acro Bike rather than the Mock Bike. Uh, could we go down to the Cable Car? No, we can because this lady right here is literally blocking the way to it. Yeah. So, here we go. Let's get it. So, as you guys can see, here is the Jagged Pass. Not a lot, but you will be able to find some interesting Pokemon. Now, the reason why I'm saying that you're going to need the Acro Bike is because you can get back up here anytime you want to just by these little tablets right here. So, what I'm going to be doing is I'm, I'm going to be battling everybody, um, sliding down these things, jumping over these ledges and all that crud. And, like I said, I'm going to be battling everybody. That means everybody and their mamas. And then we're going to be going back and, you know, redoing this whole thing if we can. I think we can. Yeah, I think we can. Okay, so here we go, taking on expert Shelby, and she will be coming out with a Meditite right here. So let's go with Gaia, the Fierce Knight, who is fully evolved right here. Look at that, she's looking all Majestic AF. Has the Trace Technique, yes. Majestic AF. Okay, so let's go with a Draining Kiss. I think it's a Fighting, I think Fighting Types are, yeah, yeah, Fighting Types are weak against uh, Fairy Types, so there we go. Finally. Okay, so there we go. And, uh, let's see. Hariyama's gonna be coming up next. I'm just, you know what? Screw it. I'm just gonna be, uh, I'm gonna be messing with this Pokemon right here, just because. And, look at this. Psychic Attack. Does its trick. Hariyama, defeated. Doesn't feel so happy and all that stuff, so there we go. And, uh, well, Tommy JDF grows to level 37 and is learning Focus Energy. That right there is another move that I'm not going to learn for right now. And Shadow Art right here grows to level 26. And is learning knockoff, which is another first person move. And I'm and I'm, I'm not going to be able to use because I guess stall, the effect stall, it, it, it affects all first person moves and all that stuff too. So, yeah, I kind of read that up. So, let's see. Where can we go? Where can we go? It, really, we can't go anywhere. We... we yeah, like, we literally can't go anywhere without the Acro Bike, so that's what we're going to be doing after we go all the way back down right here. And Lanoon, right here, has got, let's see, it has another escape rope, so, yeah, we're not going to, we're not going to battle it. I mean, this Pokemon literally evolved by just doing nothing, absolutely nothing. It is like the, <laughs> it, it, it is like the moocher of all moochers right here. So, let's go right ahead and battle some more Pokemon. Alrighty, so, here we go, taking on uh, Camper Ethan, and he will be coming out with a Gulpin, the stomach Pokemon. Alright, Thunderball, let's get it. Let's go. So, here we go, Gulpin, ready to go. I'm gonna go with an Electro Ball, and... Yeah, look at that. Finish it. That's right. We finished it. And Thunderball right there grows to level 34. And the rest of the Pokemon are growing levels like Lanoon, the ultimate moocher. And, well, there we go. That is a victory for us right there. So, let's see. I think we only have, like, one more place to go. Yeah. As you guys can see, we can go back up here, grab these items, and, you know, with the mock bike, we can't really do much. Um, you can find some interesting Pokemon right here, like you... Spoink, and what I'm trying to do right now is I'm I'm just gonna I'm just gonna battle most of these trainers, and then from there just come back. Should be it should be easy enough. And here she's coming out with a what's her face, a uh, what was it called a, a Skitty. Never wanted to use a Skitty, and well let's go Charge Beam. So here we go, Charge Beam for the win. Wow. Blasted this Pokemon like nobody's business. That is that is the funniest thing ever. And well, let's see. She's gonna be coming out with a Jigglypuff. So let's go right ahead and uh, yes, take on the, this Jigglypuff right here. Let's go. Electro Ball for the win. 
And there you go. Look at that. Alrighty. So Jigglypuff has been defeated. And, well, Gaia grows to level 31. And Nelly has been defeated herself right there. That's that's pretty good right there. Okay, so let's see. Um, there. Well, like I said, there's really... Like, we really can't do much. And right here, we're going to be finding ourselves a Numel. Numel, of course, is a Pokemon that we've, you know, we've gotten before. Unfortunately, I'm just going to skip on this. I'm going to be doing it off screen. I'm going to try and capture some, like, special Pokemon and all that stuff. So, let's see. I think we have, like, one more trainer right here. Yeah, this is the end of it right here. Yeah, this is the end. And, yeah, you can't go anywhere without this girl seeing you. So, let's go ahead and battle this girl. And here we have Picnicker Diana. And she will be coming out with her Gloom. And Gloom is looking very, very gloomy. So, here we go, taking on Gloom with a, well, Thunderball. So, let's go ahead and switch out that Pokemon. Let's go straight to Tommy JDF. It's been a while since I've actually played with this guy. Last time I seen him. I guess it's evolution and all that stuff. So here we go, Tommy JDF getting poison. Good gravy. Uh oh. So there it is, a poison, and that is not good. Okay, so let's go right ahead and go with a blaze kick. And then off screen, I did teach a aerial ace. Where did I get aerial ace? If you go to Mauville, the second vendor will be will be uh, selling uh, TMs for ten thousand. And well. Knowing us, we're not really that we're not really rich right now, but eventually you will be able to get yourself, uh, you know, quite a few TMs, pro probably every single one of them. And she's gonna be coming out with a Swablu, so let's go. Let's see, let's go with Thunderball right here. Hmm. I think eventually I'm gonna have to start switching out the Pokemon, start making a new. Uh, I'm gonna have to start introducing some newer Pokemon right here. Eh, we 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 shall see. We shall see. So here we go. Thunderball for the win. And, well, there you go. Alrighty, alrighty. And, well, Diana has been defeated. And she is not too happy about this. So, let's see. I need to heal up my Pokemon right here. Actually, there's an antidote right there. And, well, let's go right ahead. And step outside. Here we are in Route 112, going into well. Let's see. What was it called? Fall Arbor Town. Oh no, Larva Ridge. Okay. So here we are in Lava Ridge, and what we're gonna be doing right now, guys, is I'm gonna head back to Mauville so I can get the Acro back, and we will be back into the Lava Ridge area or the the Jagged Point. So I'll be right back with you guys. Alrighty, guys. So we're back into the Jagged Pass right here at the very top, and now we got ourselves the the Acro Bike right here. So what the Acro Bike can do is if you press the B button, you will be able to hop over some of these tablets right here, enabling you to you know, to go to different places. And right here, we're gonna be finding ourselves the TM43 Flame Charge. This is a move, or this is a move that I already had with uh, Blaziken. And well, we're gonna we're gonna start looking for different stuff around here, going through everything. And well, right here, and uh, looks like we're not finding anything. Holy crud baskets! Okay, so let's go right back up. And well, let's see. We can go up here and find some different stuff. So let's go right ahead and see what else we can find. And as you guys can see, bam, bam. We got ourselves the TM69 Rock Polish. That's another move for Rock-type Pokemon who, well, kind of need a speed boost. And, well, uh, it looks like to me we need to battle this guy here too because we have not battled him. So let's go right ahead and uh, do that. So here it is. Taking on Hiker Eric, and he is going to be coming out with a Graveler. And, well, look at that. Graveler is going to, it's definitely going to have a, an advantage against us. So, let's go right ahead and go with Olay. Yes, Olay. And what can we do right here? Olay, ready to go. And it does have a Bulldoze attack right here. So, here comes its Bulldoze, thinking that it was going to destroy... My good old Thunderball right here, so let's go uh, straight for the Razor Leaf attack. And yes, this Pokemon can't avoid this. 
And just like that, we hit it. And it does have sturdy, so it has one more move to give us. And that right there, yeah. <laughs> okay, let's go, bubbly beam. And this bubbly beam does the trick. Say goodbye to Graveler. Yeah, buddy. All righty. Okay, all right. And everybody else getting some points. Hiker Eric defeated. And, well, let's see. Let's go on our little adventure right here. Here we're going to be finding ourselves a full heal. And, let's see. We've already defeated her, so it looks like to me... We are going to be going back up, so let's go right ahead and do that. Right here. We're jumping up everything, and there's an item right there waiting for us. So let's go down here, and we're going to find ourselves a max ether. So let's see. There, one, there, there should be a one more item, which we probably did forget. So we're going to be going all the way to the top right here. Let's see. Let's go, right? There it is. Hibbity hoppity. There we go. I think we've already taken, uh, taken on that person. And, well, let's go right here. And just like that, look at that. Just like that, we're going to the very top yet again. Let's go right here. Right here. And, yeah, we are at the very top. And, yeah, we're going to be getting attacked by more Pokemon right here. So, here we have another Numo. Pretty cool Pokemon. Still not going to capture you because, well, shoot. I already got you. Well, not really. I don't I don't have you. I just kind of want to do this off screen. And, well, let's go right back down here. And here we're going to grab ourselves a Super Repel. And I think that is pretty much it right there for the Jagged Pass. Yeah. We pretty much went through every single spot. And, well, here is a Machop. I kind of want to know what a shiny Machop would look like. kind of want to know that. So, let's go right ahead and get out the way. And, well, let's see. Let's see. We're going to go down down the, uh, the areas where the Pokemon might attack us. And I'm trying to figure out where, oh, where are the... Well, I'm trying to figure out something else. Like, okay, so there might be a big slide around here, but... I guess we just we just surpassed it and all that stuff. So, yep, there it is, guys. We have uh, completed everything with the Acro Bike, and now here we are back in Lava Ridge Town. So, we're gonna stop it right here, guys. In the next episode, we're gonna be going for our fourth badge, and uh, hopefully that run that one turns out very very well. But yes, we're gonna be going for our fourth badge, and uh, yeah, we'll see what happens. Thank you guys again for being patient. Thank you guys again for being, uh, you know, as supportive as possible. I will be back for another episode of our Pokemon Alpha Sapphire walkthrough. See you guys.